And I had a question about uh, Rise 45 from, from the chat, which was, uh, what was my favorite part of the Rise 45 workouts? And you know the, well, there's a couple of things. Um, so I've, first of all, I'm not a CrossFit hater. I'm not a CrossFit detractor, anything like that. I have a lot of friends who are CrossFit certified, CrossFit coaches, um, unbeknownst to some folks, actually, I mean, way, way back in the beginning. So uh, Rob Wolf and I, if you know him, uh, we, uh, we used to train a couple of together many, many years ago. And so when he first moved to Chico, I, I remember we actually went to dinner with uh, Glassman and a bunch of folks, you know, right before he had gotten kind of NorCal set up. So yeah, so actually CrossFit and I actually have a little bit of a connection, but I'd never really done CrossFit style programming. And it, it was really fun. You know, I mean, there's, there's, it, it's funny. Um, there's some things you don't think about until somebody actually programs them for you. And then you're like, Oh, I guess you could do that. Like, for example, um, you know, I mean, we've all done EMOMs, right? Every minute on the minute. Uh, one of the things that they programmed for us in the Rise 45 workouts was it'd be like, you know, every three minutes at the top. And, you know, and it's funny, you don't think about doing that, but it's like, oh, yeah, I guess you could. You know, it doesn't have to be every minute on the minute. It could be every block of time at the beginning. And uh, that was really cool. Um, I think um, I'm going to definitely keep using stuff like that just for the uh, the work capacity and, you know, way to, way to scale kind of volume and intensity because that that's really fun. And, um, that was, I'd say that was one of my favorite parts, but the overall favorite part was kind of the, the core workout. Um, it's, it's really weird. I do core work. I, I do core exercises, you know, core training, but not a ton. And I'll, I'll have to admit, I haven't done much. I hadn't done much since gyms shut down and I was training at home doing kind of the pre-rise 45 stuff. So I think the combination of, um, you know, density plus core work really, really helped. I mean, I, cause I noticed, I mean, by the, you know, now that we're kind of at the end of this, the, the big change I've really noticed is in my jujitsu game. I mean, it's a lot easier for me to invert, you know, it's a lot easier for me to do, you know, things like, like, you know, shoot up and catch legs, for example, or shoot up and catch triangles. Um, and you know, I, I attribute that of course, a hundred percent to the core work. So that's something I'm going to probably keep doing. Uh, and, and, you know, it's, it's really simple stuff, you know, I mean, things like jackknives or V-sits or, you know, big threes or side plank extensions, you know, so it's not super crazy things. It's just probably stuff that, you know, I should just be doing anyway. So, and you should too.